What's going on, guys? So today I'm redynoing a bike that uh, that I worked on before. It's gone and seen some changes. Uh, I'm gonna show you what we're dealing with here. So 62, almost 63 horsepower. This bike has very few mods on it, besides suspension work. Let's uh, let's take a look, see what it has. But look at that. Look at that curve. Right now, my, my pickup sensor for RPM is kind of jacked up. So if I switch this, I need to get a new lead. If I switch this over, you can see it cuts out the RPM. This one carried out. But you can see this thing is making really good power, peaking, peaking pretty good out in power band. Um, if we go back to... Uh, speed here we see the full graph but 62 horsepower almost 63 right on the money for what these make so this bike here has our standard monster exhaust this is the shorty version full system in black and then we have FCI intake kit and a Power Commander 5. Now you might be wondering where the extra horsepower is from. Well, we did a simple install. We did three things. Fairly cheap on cost. One, we did Hot Cam 3 install. Inside here, obviously you can't see the cam. But Hot Cam 3 install, we did a plus 3 millimeter throttle body bore and we did a clutch upgrade what we call our upgrade kit which is just inner fiber full fiber mod um, cover gasket and um, heavy springs to handle the additional power so with those three things we went from 54 horse up to 62 horse now I don't know if I can find it I'm gonna look real quick so hold with me I'm gonna look and see if I can find his other dyno sheet uh, I believe it's here I don't know if it'll relate because of the rpm issue right now but okay there's the curb before Let's switch this to engine speed. All right, so maybe you can see that. So these are the two horsepower curves. Let's see. All right, well, I'm just gonna leave it like that. Let's see, I'm trying to make this easier to look at. Um, if I take that one out of there and I'll leave those. All right. So, man, what is with this glare? All right, that's a little better. So if we see, if you follow the cursor, this upper line here is what we just did. And this lower line, this dark blue one, that is with just the stock motor with bolt-ons. So you see, we picked up peak before on this dark blue one was 54 and it fell off at about 6500 rpm it was done now this one's making 62 tor uh 62 horsepower peak peak is right in this window of probably about 7500 rpm is good peak and if I was to pull this all, all the way out to uh, the red line at 9,000, it would end up right where my cursor is right here, probably in the uh, 56 range. But if we look right here at, say, 8,200 RPM, that's um, over 12 horsepower gain at that RPM. So we're not just, when we see peak numbers, say, oh, yeah, it picked up, 
you know, it went from, it picked up nine horsepower. Like, that's still a ton, but it picked up 12 at 8,200 RPM. So there's a little more of the story than just that peak number, but huge gain. There is a little bit of a um, low end loss from four to 55 with the, uh, with the camshaft a little bit. That That's not a huge deal. This is at full throttle. You barely see this amount of load in that low RPM range if you're if you're shifting how you should. Um, but huge gains for low dollar. So basically, 500 bucks in parts is getting you nine horsepower and 12 out at uh, 8,200 RPM. So if this is something uh, that interests you, give us a shout. Uh, these are real fairly easy install uh, general mechanical skills to do these installs of this sort I'll show you this fuel map as well while we're here I know a lot of guys are always interested in what the fuel map look like so um, in this top end we're seeing high 20s in fuel kind of uh, high teens through low 20s through most of this mid-range and down at idle we're in the uh, uh 13 is what this particular motor likes but nothing too extravagant these 2015 and up bikes are uh the fuel maps are entirely different than the 06 through 12s because of the ecu so um that's what we got some huge gains for not a lot of money so hit us up if uh if that's interesting you Quervo racing uh, 951-743-6328. Give us a shout. I'll be the one talking to you and answering the phone call if you do call. So, um, easy horsepower, guys. This is a quick, quick, easy, very cheap horsepower per dollar. So, at, at this range, this is about, uh, eh, with the install, it, it's almost uh, uh, one horsepower for every $100. So, uh, that's it, guys. We'll catch you on the next one.